Race number seven then is a class four contest over the uh, the 1200 metres, the final class four for the night field, headed by Aries, who drops it back into this class where he's won twice before. Inside gate should roll forward, as should Jolly Good Heart. He's drawn barrier nine. Ever Joy makes his debut for Paul O'Sullivan. Zach Purton rides from gate number seven. Star Vui runner up on his last two starts as favourite. Joe Moreira, barrier number nine, uh, sorry, barrier 11 for Star Vui. Hero Star was a course and distance winner. Two starts back, site hero, third behind Pleasant Endeavour at Char 10. And down to Happily Friends, who will jump from barrier number two. Class for a class drop here for Jimmy Ting, off a mark of 41. Now the speed map, uh, speed should be solid, I think, Emma. Ever Joy is showing a speed, including a trial with Andrew, with a win over Giveaway, please, a couple of trials ago. Jolly Good Hearts draw nine. He had barrier two last time, and Zach's gone on to the three. Side Hero, Aries the next two from Hero Star, Happily Friends, Star of Hui, Chikorita. Pretty much racing in pairs here. Exponential Destined Jewelry, Silvery Warrior and Good Buddy. So if the speed map is right off that good tempo, everybody gets their chance. They certainly do. In our seventh event uh, here, we've got a few to get through as well. But uh, we're going to start off with uh, Sight Hero. He's trained by David Hayes, but have you ridden by Chad Schofield? Chad, Sight Hero, you've ridden him at his last couple of runs. Is he heading in the right direction? I think so. Um, he showed good... Um, good fight last time. He crossed over from a wide gate um, and he fought on well for third. It was a good run and after that David thought he'd be suitable for Happy Valley and I, I agreed and um, he's got a lovely draw tomorrow night and he should run well. So why do you think he's suitable for Happy Valley? Well he's got that early, early pace, he can get up on the speed and then um, he can kick off that as well. So class 4, 1200 I think that, that's perfect for him. So has it just taken a little bit of time for him to put it together to get the experience he needs to produce on race day? Yeah, he's a big horse um, and he's, he's slowly improving all the time and I think he's come on again from his latest run, so hopefully he can get his first win out the way. All right, that's sight here. Lots of confidence there from, uh, from Chad about his chances. The gate, obviously, is key for him. Star of Wui, though, uh, Mark, runner up on his last two starts. Uh, Chikorita and Exponential also to consider. Yeah, taking Star of Wui out of this race, Andrew, he was held up at the top of the straight, and good luck, good luck, went like a Learjet this night. He has failed since, but that was up in grade. Good luck, good luck, where he has struggled. He's, well, he's drawn white again here, Paul, star of Hui, but he's certainly in the top four. Oh, no, I, I like him, this horse. I mean, he's been beaten favourite the last two, and he was just unlucky there. He got held up, and the other horse had the first run on him, so I think he can atone here. OK, good buddies. Just had three starts so far, Paul, but this was a, a better effort from him. Yeah, it was. It was a nice run from him. He's only had the limited starts. Uh, but both those uh, runs, the first two runs, he finished towards the back at Happy Valley at massive price. It was a massive price in this race as well, but still ran uh, nicely here at Chartin. So they are coming back to Happy Valley. He's just drawn 10. Like him if he can get some luck. You can see him just probing up there on the inside. Now, the reason that I like him is the fact he's made good ground here. Fantastic Treasures won the race and won again since. And everyone's delight who finishes almost alongside him on the outside has won since this race. On that, I like him at the value. All right, probably won't be over 100 to 1 uh, this time round. So what about Everjoy, uh, Mark? He's the, the first starter from the O'Sullivan barn. He's had uh, four trials. The last two have been at Happy Valley. Now, this is his last one. You can see here he jumps OK. He does get quite keen when horses surround him and go in front of him here, Paul, going into the back straight. Zach's ridden him in all of the trials. He's drawn in barrier number seven. Aries gets their head up there. If he settles or indeed can run along in front like he does when he beat Giveaway Please in that trial, he's certainly a good chance of winning on debut. I think they'll let him go. They're trying to educate him here and it didn't really pay off, I thought, because the horse uh, over race, as you said. So from barrier seven, I think they'll take the chance and go forward with him. As you say, he's had the four trials. He's pretty fit. £1,073 for him. And two of those four trials have been there at Happy Valley as well. But it is uh, Star Wui. Uh, Favourites once more. Paul, can he go one better? I think he can. Uh, they, I think those two, both two runs have been pretty good. He was just beaten on the bob two starts ago and got too far back last time. So he's on top. Side Hero's got the good draw. Ever Joy, uh, the first start of the pace. I think Aries can get a nice run just in behind. And uh, he's looked good in, up in Chungfa in his work. Six, nine, three and one. Good buddy. With the improvement he showed at Sharts in last time, especially with the horses that beat him and finished around him, it was a strong field. He's at 25 and 6.2 and he's a Group 1 winning rider with Lexi Bedell on his back. Side Hero's got a beautiful draw. Chad sounded confident in that interview as well. Three ever joy. I think, as Paul said, they'll just let him run along in front and six star of Hui. Wide draw, getting close to a win. Seven, nine, three and six. 
I'm quite keen on uh, Sight Hero here from that uh, low gate. Good run behind Pleasant Endeavour last time out at Shah 10. I think he can make it count under Chad Schofield for David Hayes. That's uh, race number seven, final class four of the night.